Forget bland and boring. When it comes to interior design, you want to be inspired. Hello, I'm Kelsey Hubbard, and I'm here with Michael Maloney from Extreme Makeover Home Edition. And we're going to show you how to take an Asian inspiration. It is the year of the dragon, after yes, all. Yes. And bring it into your home. Let's go. Okay, Michael, what'd you find? Well, I'm loving all of the sculptures right here. You've got Buddha heads, you've got full-on Buddhas, and look how they glaze them in different colors, too. Yeah. So if you have a theme and a color going through the house, you know, you could put one of these, one of these in a bookcase, really beautiful, one of the heads like that on top of a bookcase. Again, really has impact, it has drama, but you're not going overboard. Already I'm seeing a little whimsy. Here. Right, how fun for a kid's know, room, right? Yeah. To hang these over a little girl's bed would be so cute. There's all different choices in here, and they're so reasonable. A whole box of these is only $12. Well, that's what I wanted to ask you about, because yeah. a lot of people, when they think of an interior design project, they see dollar signs just yeah. calculating yeah. in their head, and so they back away, but you really can do it on a budget if you're And smart. you don't have to do it all at once. Right. You know, but I mean, what little girl wouldn't want this hanging over her bed? This is pretty awesome, isn't it? Look how beautiful this is. Yeah, very detailed. Details. Right? And I also like that it's natural, so it's not going to fight with anything else in the room. You know, there's so much influence right now with like, even this kind of thing, raw wood and all of that um, sort of influence. So this is a really elegant way to bring that in. That could divide a room, right. you know, very elegant in a living room. It could also just go in the corner with a beautiful like, palm in front of it. I love these. They're sort of a pagoda shape. They're nylon lanterns. And again, you can, you know, keyless is, is one of those ceramic things you just screw a bulb in. Okay. Right? This can just go right on top of that. Or they look great in the backyard, front yard, hanging in a tree. Right. Really, I think they're really elegant and really pretty. And they definitely speak of, of Asian culture. When you decide to go for a theme, is there a fine line between kind of being subtle and then going over The line is not fine. <laughs> it's a big nice. black line in the sand. <laughs> So, if, so people are watching and they want to get a little bit inspired. I mean, this yeah. is the year of the dragon. Maybe yes. they're going to go Asian. Exactly. Uh, how do they do it without well, you know, like, like, crossing that line? Well, you know, on the show, the kids' rooms that we did were really over the top. Right. Theme, theme, theme. I think in a kids' room, that works. In common spaces, living room, dining room, kitchens, you know, what we're talking about today is influence. Right. So little influence. Just do touches. And, you know, you could paint a room with Chinese red and not have anything else Chinese in it. I mean, this is fun and we just had fun with it, but it's actually a very sculptural piece. I don't love the finish on this, but if you did that in black lacquer and put that on a, on a sofa back table, really it's elegant, really right? In a family room or living room. Light hits it, and it is, it's, 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 it's very nice. sculptural and it's fun. Yeah. All right, next. Do your homework. Number one, go shopping, see what's out there. Use the internet, such a great tool to see what's available. Um, shop or you can return stuff. Yeah. So you could take it That's home and one. try it and yeah. see if you like it. You know, a lot of your um, interior design stores or home furnishing stores will let you take it on what they call memo. You leave a check and you take it home for a day and you try it out. Show the husband, yeah. you know? <laughs> <laughs> but if you're not sure, it's just a great way to get it in the house. And then, I mean, third of all, I would just say go for it. Yeah. You know, you gotta have some guts and get in there and, and take a risk, have a little fun with it. Right. And if you're not confident, if you have a friend like who you love their house, you love their style, Take them shopping with you and, and make it a fun thing for you and a friend to do together.